Hey everybody, welcome back to The Shave Den. It's Ken Surfs here, and we are gonna be trying a new razor today from Pearl Shaving. I have not tried this yet. In fact, I just opened it up out of the box to uh, take the intro video of this. And it's the L55 Antique Brass Razor. Comes like that. And... Comes with a polishing cloth, some blades. Well, hang on, let me get the razor out of there. Here's the razor, antique brass, solid weight, very solid weight. I'm trying to see what blades they're giving me. Let's see. They're giving me these blades. But I don't want to try these blades because maybe these blades don't work good for me. I'm going to use a blade that I know works good for me, so then I'll be able to tell how the razor works. So I will not be using the blades that actually came with this today. But I will be using the very mild uh, Wilkinson Sword Gillette from India. Uh, these blades. <laughs> it's lunchtime on Friday. How are you guys doing? Welcome. It's good to be back here. All right. Here is the razor. Let's see. It's a nice three-piece razor. Actually, the thread lockup's real nice on that. Sometimes you can get them and they're very floppy. Very nice. It's got some good knurling here, which is going to be handy because my hands are going to be pretty slick soon. It's got the pearl emblem on the bottom of it. And it is nice and tight lockup, three-piece razor. Very good. So let me see if I can get the blade into this. You guys been having a good week? Hope all is well. It's the weekend now. Going to go to the movies with my brother tonight and crack up and see Cocaine Bear. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. All right. Plus, go play some pinball. All right. Let's put the blade in here. Oh, no overhang. No overhang. A lot of you like that, no overhang. I kind of like it, but some people do not. Okay, let me put that in. There you go. No overhang. Very flush. Like I said, a nice weighty razor. So I'm gonna be using that today. It's been really cold, windy, rainy. You can see California's under snow. We never get snow. People are trapped in their houses. I barely got out of Cambria last week. They closed all the roads behind me, flooded. I've been getting some rain. Thank goodness, we need it. but my skin's dried out. <laughs> so I'm gonna be using Nivea Men today. I'm gonna to be using the uh, shave soap or shave cream, and I'm gonna be using the aftershave balm, and I'm gonna use the uh, Sinogue bore brush. In fact, let me put the bore brush into the crystal skull right now. There we go. I've got two of these Sinogues. They're really good brushes. I've got... Uh, the black version and then the red version. And you can tell they're very well used because they're good brushes. All right. I've got uh, definitely some growth, see? There's no hiding that. I am gonna try growing out my goatee again. So then I can have a nice new razor, do a knock it down, take it off later. But I'm gonna grow out the goatee a little bit. So I will, I hope I don't forget in the middle of the shave, I'm gonna uh, shave around the goatee. I'm gonna turn this it's not like a turtleneck, but it's got a pretty high collar. There we go. Now I can get to everything. All right. You ready to start the shave? Let's go. Nice hot water. And if you haven't seen the channel before, I do keep a, a bowl of hot water in here. This is what I rinse off my uh, razor with. That way I don't get all the junk down the sink. And then at the end, I throw that bowl down the toilet and flush it. I'm not going to plug up the drains this way. All right. Gonna use this. 
going to do a face lather. We're going to try to do a face lather. Here we go. Put a little soap on there. We'll see if that's enough. Mmm, nice fresh sim. Oh man. Face lather is very easy. Very, very easy. I know I'm not shaving the goat, but I need the lines to guide. Okay. There we go. Yeah, I took last week off work, so this week's been very, very busy catching up. So I didn't see a lot of uh, a lot of videos coming out from Ken Surf's uh, shaved in. Plus, I was waiting for that razor to arrive, and there's another one coming out. Pearl's putting out some good razors, and that one that that cost on Amazon. It's it's available on Amazon, so it's not hard to obtain. And uh, it's right around 20 bucks. So, you know, not bad. Well, let's see how she performs. Oh, first of all. I don't want to be eating the soap. All right, let's see how she performs. Hear the feedback? Oh. Almost did it. Almost forgot. And I'm growing out the goatee. I goofed. It's Lent, right? Friday. I ordered a egg McMuffin today. I'm about to take a bite and I go. Took the ham out, gave it to my dog. He was very happy. <laughs> Got to try to keep on the right track, right? I really like the weight of this, and it is nice and grippy. So that's good. It's got a nice long handle, antique brass. You know, I I, I can tell because I'm I'm feeling my beard, but uh, you can see it too. It's knocked down almost 100% of it. So a lot of times you don't really have to go several passes on these. You want that baby BBS shave, and then I guess uh, that's okay. But sometimes if you're in a hurry, one pass will do. But you shouldn't be in a hurry when you're shaving, you know, unless you forget and you've got to head out to work or you've got a date or something's going on. But uh, if you got time, might as well enjoy yourself. You ever notice how long ladies take in the shower? Oh my gosh, or the bath. The guys are in and out. So if you're shaving, yeah, treat yourself to a little luxury. Here we go. Feedback. There you go. There you go. brush shed. I probably had that brush over 10 years. Yep, shedding. Perfect. Perfect. Now look. <laughs> look like Santa Claus here coming in with a white beard.
But fear not, I have shoe polish to put on my goatee. I don't dye my hair, uh, except here and here. And I don't do it because I'm vain. It's just that, you know, it looks kind of, I like it just one solid color. But if you use the products for, like, what is it? Uh, just for men, that stuff's real good, but it only seems to last like a week or so and then it washes out. And I got salt and pepper here, but you know, that's a video for another day, right? No nicks, no cuts, very smooth shave. All right, for sensitive skin. No burn today, gents. All right, put too much on again, probably. No burn, just soothing. And it's dry weather. You know, it's it's wet, but it's very dry. Well, my wife's got the heater on, but, you know, a couple of hundred degrees in the house here. Actually, she keeps it about 74. I drop it down to about 70. It's just too much at night. There we go. All right. Now, that performed much better than one of your $20 drugstore or pharmacy razors. I've got to admit that. I didn't uh, didn't have any issues. And like I said, the price point is, is really good. And uh, they do have some higher end uh, razors from Pearl that cost a little more, but you know, if you can get away with it with a $20 razor, why not? Good gift, right? Good gift. See, it just gets a little dull. There we go, wiped it down. There we go, not bad people at Pearl, keep up the good work. All right, well, I think that's it. Ready for the weekend? Look, see, I still got, <laughs> uh, still got shave soap all over me. All right, ready for the weekend? Ready to see a, a crazy horror comedy tonight? Cocaine Bear with my brother, play a little pinball and uh, getting ready for the weekend. So thank you very much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. I know there's a lot of channels out there. I do appreciate you tuning into mine. And uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button. I really do appreciate it. All right, everybody. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time.